Today I will try soldier's food and if I'm honest I already tried some of those and it's not quite tasty but today I will do it again for you guys so you can have a little bit of, um, of a point how tasty or how not tasty is soldier's food. For the first meal I will have this adventure breakfast. It's the one meal that I didn't try before so let's give it a go and let's see how good it actually is. So firstly we need to remove oxygen absorber, that's very important because you don't want to eat this. Then we need to pour a water like it's shown here. Let's do it right away. Then we need to close it and wait a bit for the meal to cook. Meanwhile I will prepare another meal, it's called Pesta Bellonese and it's usually used for lunch. So let's give it a go. Also we need to open it up first. Then remove oxygen absorber. And you also need to pour some boiling water. Here we go, here we go. Alright. So for this meal we have to wait around, it's called, um, yes, for this meal we have to wait 8 minutes as well, so I will give a timer, 8 minutes, and after 8 minutes we are ready to go with our first meal. If I'm honest I'm quite scared because I know how this food tastes. So while we are waiting for these two meals to get ready, I will eat this uh, dessert. It's a uh, dessert from, uh, it's actually yogurt and vanilla. So let's try it right away. Also remove the oxygen absorber. So let's pour some water. Doesn't need to be hot. We need to mix it a little bit. So I just read that we need 8 minutes for this as well. So we will have to wait 8 minutes for everything to be ready and I will come back to you. Okay, so 8 minutes just passed and now it's my turn to try breakfast first. Yikes! I will mix it a little bit. Here you can see the texture. Well, if I'm honest, the breakfast is quite good. Mm. Hmm. This meal actually surprised me quite a bit. I haven't tried it yet and I must say it's really good and my honest review would be let's say 6. It's, it's quite good. 6 out of 10. So for the next meal we have pasta bolognese. This one I didn't quite like when I was on the military training but let's give it a go and I will give you an honest review for this as well. Mm. So the smell is not quite um, pleasing. Here you can see the texture. Let's give it a go. If you are really hungry, then this meal is not that bad, but in my case, um, I would give it 
let's say I will give it three, three out of ten. It's not, uh, it's not really tasty, but uh, as I said, if you are very hungry and on the rain, and it's very cold outside, this uh, meal it's, it's very appreciated. So the next one, it's the dessert. So let's see how it tastes like. The texture it's similar to the to the cream, something like that. Um, the taste it's really sweet. Mm. But I think mm, I think I pour too much water in it, so it doesn't taste as as good. But um, mm, those solid parts are are actually quite good. I would give it I would give it a rate seven out of ten. It's quite it's quite good. Quite solid food, especially if you if you are low on energy, this will really give you a boost, um, boost of sugar. So for the last thing, I have the tea with the lemon. So let's try, let's try it. So this tea is for 800 milliliters. You can you can really make a use of it. Hmm. It's like a real tea, actually. Um, if I'm rating, if I would be rating like real teas, I would give this. A rate uh, probably eight out of ten. It's really, it's it's actually really good. Mm. Amazing. So guys, this is the end of the video. If you have any experience tasting food like this, uh, you can share your thoughts and your experiences down in the comments, and we will have a discussion there. Thank you for watching, and I will hopefully see you in my future videos as well. Bye. Mm.